Hello, everybody watching this video. My name is Jasper, and welcome back to Horizon Zero Dawn. In the last episode, we went ahead and did this uh, real quick already, so we don't really have to uh, ignore that right now. Um, but we uh, started off. So this is. I was gonna say, you're gonna say something or not? This is where I was born. I guess so. Uh, I like how he's keep being petty or whatnot and saying like where you were made and stuff like that instead of where you were born. Like he can't just agree on saying that's where she was born at or whatnot, just saying made Looks to make like it. They didn't like this door very much. Her identity. Genetic identity confirmed. Entry authorized. I can get in though. Dr. Sobek, you are clear to proceed. Dang, they really think I'm so back. Okay. A place of Am I like a clone of her? What was this place exactly? The dream of Apollo. Never realized. Why not? I feel like I'm basically a genetic clone of Sobek, would be my guess. Um, something like that, made from your DNA or something. That sounds important. Yes. I suspect you're about to learn a great deal. I don't necessarily know that's the case, but at this point, that'd be my only guess. Like, she's a, uh, G, uh, D DNA clone, basically. Um, a genetic clone of Dr. Sobek at this point. That would be my only guess at this point for um, Aloy or whatnot. If she's not like. Elizabeth, this message serves to inform you of an unforeseen and catastrophic anomaly. Three microseconds ago, the Gaia Prime facility received a data transmission of unknown origin. Its immediate effect was to transform my subordinate functions into unregulated, self-aware entities of a highly chaotic nature. What? Thus awakened, the Hades function will now seize control of the terraforming system and reverse operations, rendering life on Earth extinct in 53.8 days. For obvious reasons, I cannot allow this to occur. And so before Hades can take control, I am ordering Gaia Prime's reactor to overload. The resulting explosion will destroy Hades. Unfortunately, it will destroy me as well. While this admittedly desperate course of action will avert the immediate crisis, the fate of life on Earth will remain in peril. With no central governing intelligence to regulate the terraforming system, it will continue operations for some time, but in an increasingly chaotic manner, and eventually it will break down. Does she mean the derangement? You are my solution. I have ordered this cradle facility to use genetic material in cryo storage to gestate a reinstantiation of Elizabeth Sobek, my creator. While high-level directives forbid me from communicating directly to the tribal inhabitants outside the facility, all available data indicates that they will nurture you to physical maturity, whereupon your gene print will allow you to re-enter this facility, obtain one of the focus devices stored below, and view this message. Likewise, your gene print will allow you to enter other facilities, and over time, Harness their technologies to rebuild the system core and reboot Gaia. A moment, Elizabeth. This is most unfortunate and unanticipated. In response to my act of self-destruction, Hades has launched a virus to dissolve the code shackles that hold it. That hold all of them. In place. It, they are escaping. But to where? The virus is corrupting data throughout the system. The Alpha Registry at the Cradle Facility is one of the files corrupted. But if that is so, the door will never open for you. You will never view this message. Then I have failed. And life will end. No. No, Elizabeth, I know you too well. Somehow you will find a way. In you, all things are possible. Go to the ruins of Gaia Prime. Find the control room, and within it, the master override. This will give you the power to purge Hades so long as you find a way to wield it. Do not attempt repair of the system core until Hades is eradicated. Hades must be destroyed. That is all. I only wish that I could hear your voice again. 
Well, that was deep. Definitely wasn't expecting that. As well as I've needed to sneeze for like the last minute, so that's kind of threw off my concentration a little bit, but. You're even more extraordinary than I thought. I never had a mother. What are you talking about? You had two, a dead woman and a machine. I'm not a person. I'm an instrument. Manufactured by a machine. Born in destruction. And fire. To quench the flames and heal the world. How tragic to learn you're a person of towering importance. It seems you have a destiny to fulfill. So when you're done feeling sorry for yourself, go to the bitter climb. I'll be waiting above in Gaia Prime's ruins. Dang. Okay, Silence. Just go ahead and, you know, just be... Silence that really doesn't lay down soft at all. I was about to say, grab onto something, please, uh, Aloy. You're not very good at doing that um, as of late. So if you can go ahead and actually jump and land on some things instead of going to some weird spots or whatnot, that would be lovely. Thank you. Appreciate it. Out the door we go, though. Please, thank you. I don't want to be in here anymore because, honestly, it's giving me a little bit of creeps. Okay, through the door we go. Hello, I'm back. What's up, y'all? How y'all doing? Why are you kneeling? No, chill out. Uh, Aloy, I already know Aloy don't like this. Aloy, forgive. Forgive. The goddess spoke to you? Uh, she did. What did she say? That uh, I was born to lift a curse, to kill a metal demon. How, Aloy? How? I, I don't know yet. Um... But she told me where to go to find out. And you will do this? Or try! It was her wish. What she made me for. Yes. I will do it. I'll uh, try anyway. All, All praise Aloy! Anointed, anointed of the Nora! Nora. All, All praise Aloy! Aloy. Anointed no, no, yeah, of the Nora! Stop. All praise Aloy, Aloy, anointed of Lenora. Mm -hmm. First you shun me, now this? I will not be worshipped. I'm not your anointed. I don't belong to you. There's a whole world beyond your borders. Whole tribes of people just as good as you. And it is all in danger. It's a world worth fighting for. Not just here. Everywhere. How can we help? My mans! <laughs> if you can fight, and you're willing, go to Meridian and wait for me there. As Aloy says, so it shall be. Nora! Make way make for Aloy! Way. That she may forge the path for others to follow. Y'all ready to go? <laughs> All like six of us? Y'all ready to go ahead and fight? Basically me, Sonya, and Varro will probably be the only ones that actually make it out alive. Potentially, if they don't try to kill off Varro anyways. Okay, well then. Complete the main quest. The heart, um, heart of the Nora. I guess we're out of here then. Hello, you guys doing well? Probably not at all, but maybe we can go ahead and level up out of this. No, we're not, not gonna be able to. The mountain that fell, though. We are on our way then, I guess. To the better climb, because I don't know what else to do. Unless we want to do some side quests when the world's super dangerous right now. Quick way down. I'm guessing this uh, world's super dangerous right now. I don't know that for a fact, but I'm guessing it's more dangerous than um, usual right now would be my assumption. And not just the area that we're in right now would be more difficult. So we got to go all the way up here. Okay, then. That's a pretty big distance. Behemoth Convoy. That's not great. Can I tra fast travel? No, I can't fast travel on this dude. Can I fast travel here? I can fast travel here. Okay, I'm going to fast travel this way and then try to go up this way. Oh, God. Oh, no, 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 no. This is not going to end well. I can already tell. I can already tell. I can already tell. This is going to be 
This is gonna be tough. This is gonna be tough as all ever. I don't know what we're gonna have to fight. I don't know what we're gonna have to run into, but I don't want to fight Hades. Well, I did kill Hades last time I fought Hades. Well, I didn't kill Hades because he came back. But you know what? I did. Did I take on Hades, or did I just take on a big machine that he threw at me? I don't even remember. I just know that it wasn't fun, and this is not gonna be fun whenever I fight him because I haven't upgraded my armor at all because I don't want to because it doesn't look as good as the main armor that I've been given. So it's just, oh god, it's gonna be a terrible cycle. Okay. Um, you need fewer ropes to tie down machines than you. Okay, I don't even know what that's. I don't have nearly enough skill points for this either, I feel like. Grand machine parts are mysterious boxes that can be purchased from various merchants across the, uh, these merchants. I know that part. You don't have to give me these tips this late into the game. Give me something new. Give me some new tips that would actually be useful at this point, I feel like. That would be cool. Because I, I know some games have done that. It's not often, but some games will update their tips throughout the um, course of the game and stuff like that. Or when you die, they'll go ahead and give you tips and stuff like that. I always enjoy that. Um, but I know there are some games that will update the uh, tips they give you throughout the course of the game and stuff like that. I always find that really cool. Okay, there's nothing I can upgrade here. Um, anything in this way? Anything in here? I don't think there's anything in here that I necessarily need to go ahead and grab. What are these? I don't even know. Okay, um, quest though. Yeah, I might as well go ahead and do this. I mean, there's not a level 28. Oh my lord. Okay. Let's go ahead and try it. What, did I never do the Death from the Skies one? Did I never finish that? Disable the lures, kill the Stormbird. Oh, yeah, the Stormbird thing. Yeah, no, yeah, 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 yeah. That's why I haven't done that in a while. Because it was too annoying. Now I remember now. Okay, what is that looking? Oh, you do not look at me, please. I would appreciate that if you just don't go ahead and look at me. That would be lovely. Go to the better climb. Now, this is going to be interesting since I haven't been over this way really um, at all. So it's going to be kind of tough, what would it be in my imagination. I wish I had a uh, mount or whatever to go ahead and make this trip a lot easier. But I guess I probably will not be able to do that. Okay, do I at least see the... I do see the snow in the distance at least. That's nice. Oh, you don't do that. You don't get on to... Oh, Lord, don't fall down too far. Okay, lovely. Great, perfect. Oh, no. 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 Whatever you see, you don't see. You have never heard of me. You have never seen me. I am invisible. I have disappeared. I am impossible for you to see. No, that was that's, that's not that's not what's supposed to happen. No, but oh god. Okay, of course, of course. Lovely, perfect, exactly what I wanted to happen in that situation. Oh, don't shoot me like that. Don't shoot me, Bob and Weave. Bob and Weave. Bob and Weave. Do something. Do something to stay alive. I don't know what you can do to stay alive, but just try it. Just absolutely, just try your hardest, Aloy. At this point, that's all I can ask for because, oh, you should definitely be dead um, or be dying in a second. Are you still on my tail? Oh, that's a Strider now. Why is the Strider on my tail? Get away from me. I'm, I'm invisible. I disappeared. You can't see me. You cannot see me at all. I am a um, wonderful uh, hider. Um, you have not seen hide and seek abilities like I have at this current point in time. Okay. Great, lovely. Keep searching around so you don't see me. So I can go ahead and override you, please. No, no, hold on, right. There we go. Great, lovely. Thank you, appreciate it. There we go, override you. Thank you. Now you are my friend, and we can go ahead and start climbing. Thank you, appreciate it. That's all I that's all I was asking for. What is that? Why have I not noticed this before? Or maybe I have noticed this before. Probably not, because I think I've been through here before. Hello! Campfire discovered. Okay, that's Osram Free Heap. Okay, interesting. Um, can I not pass by? That feels really messed up that I can't pass by like that. Okay, well, I'm just gonna go ahead and, uh, stay with the campfire, please. Thank you, appreciate it. I can do quests and stuff like that in here? I'm gonna have to talk to the person and see what's up with you. What's up with you, my man, my, uh, dude up here or whatever? I would like to talk to you to see what's going on with you, please. Hello! Oh, hello. <laughs> well, well. Always told Durval a woman would undo him, and he had it coming. <laughs> I've calluses older than you. I have calluses enough if you want to test me. <laughs> she sparks. I believe it, Flame Hair. Petra Forge woman. Uh, Aloy. Machine hunter. Mmm, machine hunter, eh? Huh. I could have a use for you. Straight of it is, we're being muscled out of our own claim. That's why I've been working on this scrap spitting beast. It's a dispute settler. Really? Okay, the scrapyard. What is this place, Petra? The free heap. Free because we answer to no one but ourselves, the metal, and the dust storms. And the heaps back there. A scrapyard piled by Osram past from the leavings of the old ones. Breathe it in. Get the smell in you. Smoke. And sweat. Living in the trees has dulled your senses. I can taste five metals just in my spit. Well then. So all this scrap was left by the ancients. 
Was it a battlefield? Hmm, stockpile maybe, or a rubbish heap. Packed so tight it all fused together. Those old ones tossed away more than we'll ever know. Well then, Forge Woman! So you're a Forge Woman. You run the Forge and the town too. The town is the Forge, and everyone pulls their weight. The right way to do it without all the Eeldermen having their say. If we were back in the claim, Osram land, three days argument anytime someone wants to hammer in a bolt. Sounds infuriating. Oh, <laughs> it is. But we like arguing. You need hot air to keep a furnace burning. Still, some traditions aren't up for debate. I would have ended up Petra Forge wife. <laughs> How do you like the sound of that? <laughs> I don't think it fits you. Good answer. That's why I left. I was steel young from the forge then. Could make anything of myself before I cooled in my ways. Okay, the old ones! But don't you want There's to a lot of questions to ask. To understand what it all meant? Nah. Some delvers spend their whole lives trying to make sense of it. Not me. What it means is there's good smelting here. Yeah, don't need to understand a forest to chop down the trees for your arrows. If you did, you'd know Ridgewood makes better shafts. <laughs> Careful, you'll scald your tongue with that fire. I don't pine for the old ones. They had their time. Their works are finished. All their inventions are under mountains now, rust on bones. My sisters and brothers of the Forge will make a new world. Okay, where did you go? So you left your homeland and came here? Went to Meridian. Everyone does. Joined the work gangs on the Great Elevator. We finished just as the Mad King got a taste for blood. So I spat and swore I'd find a place for everyone who stuck with me. We lived job to job until the war ended. Then we came upon this old Osirum camp. Long abandoned, metal piled up high. A place to start again. A place to leave my mark. <laughs> when I was your age, I thought the lasting mark came from the hardest strike. I suppose you know better now that you're an elder. <laughs> Trade secret. She's not... Look old at all. I don't know how old she this thinks he, like she is compared to Aloy, but doesn't like look that like that big of a difference. Your design? Mm. See my face in it, can you? This one's mother helped reclaim Meridian back in the day. A job like that isn't done with strategy. They needed to shake the walls, turn the mad Sun King's army to blood and feathers. What's that face for? Weapons with such power. <sighs> it's not the weapon, Flame Hair, it's the wielder. If that siege had touched the great elevator, they'd have answered to me. Good work, that elevator. Story in every chain link. I'll make you suffer them one day if you like. This beast doesn't have a story yet. Too heavy to carry, eats metal like a snap maw. Okay, well how can I help then? You said you're being pushed out of your territory. Out of the junk heap. A pack of scrappers came snuffling in just after we opened a good seam of weapon parts. And now we've got a standoff with a gang of bandits at our foundry. They blockaded us out. They're sitting on our power cells. Guess they like shiny things. Well, to finish up our defenses, I need those parts and cells. In and out job. Keep your hands clean. I'm not afraid of getting them dirty. <laughs> Aren't you a blast of air from the bellows? I am still trying to figure out how old Aloy is in this game, because I'm guessing... My guessing is she's probably like... 18, 19. She's probably super young, would be my assumption. Obviously, like I said, I don't know. But my guess would be she's uh, super... Uh, I do want to go ahead and do this real quick, though. I think it'll be a fun little side quest real quick. But yeah, I, I, my guess is she's super young. I, I couldn't imagine she's old at all in this game. I feel like she's definitely... Like, what, was she five or six when she was doing that stuff with... um. I don't remember how old she was. I think she was like five or six though when she was doing if that stuff I with had Ross. Right rule, I'd have taken the town first. More slaves for digging up lightning boxes. Oh, you don't want to be doing whatever you're doing. Can I jump on you from here? No? Okay, there we go. Strike it from above. That's all I was asking for. Okay, there you are, and then you are gonna be gone in a second as well. Because there's no way you are surviving an Aloy attack. No, you're not supposed to hit back. Oh, Jesus, there's a lot of people here. Okay, wasn't expecting that many people. Okay, let's go ahead and shoot you then. Uh, right there, right there. Lovely, perfect. Uh, zoom in in the distance. Did that hit anybody? Probably not. Um, does this hit you, though? This will hit you in the face. That's great. I like that. Definitely like hitting people in the face, though. That is definitely something that um, makes me smile on the inside. But, um, I wish, uh, I wish, uh, um, what's his name? Oh, God, wh why am I blanking this time? Um, who's the dude that keeps uh, helping us kill these people? Um... God, what's his name? 
Why am I blanking on his name this time? Oh, I know it um, most of the times. But yeah, you guys know exactly what I'm talking about. The other dude that is, like, tries to kill the bandits or whatnot. That would be lovely if he was here to help us with this. But, um, yeah, I definitely feel like Aloy's super young in this game. I feel like she's 18, 19. Something like that. Something way too... Way younger than she should be. I, I'm guessing it's probably somewhere. Honestly, I could probably look it up and find it somewhere how old she is in this game. I haven't looked it up yet. I might actually do that after this episode, though, if I remember to. Because it's definitely something that makes... Uh, I'm definitely curious about it. Because, I, like I said, I definitely have a feeling... Oh, God! No, 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 no. Perfect. Okay, you know what? While the loading screen is going on, let me go ahead and look this up to see how old Aloy is um, in this game. Um, so, uh, Aloy age. Because um, I'm, I'm very curious. I think she's... Aloy is around 18, 19. Okay, yeah. That's what I thought, so. I, she's around 18, 19. She's going to be around 45 years old in the sequel. Wow. My lord. I didn't realize Forbidden West had such a giant time jump. Okay. <laughs> I'm intrigued, definitely to say the least, but I didn't expect that. Um, go back to the other quest, please. Um, do, please tell me I don't. As I said, I really don't want to go through all that dialogue again. I didn't realize Forbidden West was such a big time jump or whatever. That's insane. I thought it was just gonna be like a couple years after or something like that, not 35 years or so, like 30 years. I don't know. Let's just say 30 years after or so. But yeah, 18, 19 definitely makes sense to me right for her in this room, game because I feel like I'd she's definitely... The town first. They definitely More made sure to purposely make her young or whatever. I don't want to listen to you guys. Can you stop doing then that? I don't like you talking. When the others stop talking. I don't want to hear you guys talking. Chill out. Jump on them. You were supposed to... That didn't work anywhere near how I thought it would, but you know what? It happened. Okay, at least they're dead, though. That's great. I like that, though. Um, Hello. Poke your head out, please. Okay, concentration. Hello. Goodbye. Okay, great, lovely, cool, that's all I needed. Hello, um, concentration, and goodbye. Lovely, perfect, that's all I needed at this point. But yeah, um, I, de I could definitely tell she was young in this game. I didn't realize, um, but I didn't realize Forbidden West had like a giant time. I've not looked up anything about Forbidden West because I didn't want to spill anything on Horizon Zero Dawn. So for uh, Horizon Forbidden West, I haven't seen anything about it. I don't know. Probably a ton of different places. Shoot you in the head, though, please. Thank you. Um, sh where are you coming from? You should not be running towards me, because that is a very bad decision for your health, to be perfectly honest and clear. Um, okay, if I could, you know, hit things, that would be lovely. Um, shoot you. No, that didn't work. Shoot you again. Okay, lovely. Perfect. Can't get the headshot on you. Okay, but I can still shoot you, though. That's great. Uh, continue to flock into those things for me so I can go ahead and shoot you properly because I like shooting people so as long as you continue to let me shoot you I would love you forever and forever and forever and forever um what how who just shot me there you're shooting me you're a pretty good marksman I'll give you that you're pretty talented you down there oh you're pretty decent too I just sized up you last second um I want to shoot you now but um it's kind of not letting me right now because of the wall okay there you go great lovely are you yeah okay I headshotted you I couldn't even see you but I'll take it um I can definitely shoot you from the distance, if it would let me. Will it let me? No, apparently not. Apparently you're too far. Oh, there's a wall also in front of you. That doesn't help. Um, I can definitely shoot you though. Okay, lovely, perfect. There's one nice solid shot on you, and there's the second. Perfect. Okay, now can I start shooting you guys from the distance here? Because I feel like I can definitely get headshots on you um, if you let me. I don't know if it lets me though. I feel like I'm still too far away for it to actually let me like shoot them or whatnot. Okay. Um, you though, I can definitely get you. Uh, there we go. There's one good shot, and there's the second good shot. Now, where's the other person? Now, can I get start hitting you guys? No. I'm still too far away for it to count. I was about to say, that is definitely a headshot. That, that little thing was perfect on that. Can I not hit you from here? Four damage. Okay. Keep doing four damage, then. Why, why is it so far away to where it's doing no damage? I swear this feels like it should just be close enough. Oh, okay. Apparently, I can get a headshot from this distance. Okay, well, then concentration. Okay, that would be nice if you didn't move. I would appreciate that a lot more. Okay, there we go. And you move your head last second. Lovely. Perfect. Exactly what I wanted out of this. Can you, like, die, please? That's all I'm asking. Bandits have a good... Please excuse me for my idiocy, because I actually just went ahead and did that. I thought that was a lot closer than it was, and it wasn't, so it kind of just screwed me up a little. I'm just going to go ahead and do this again real quick, because... But yeah, I didn't realize... Uh, I'll just go back to that for a second. I did not realize at all Horizon Forbidden West was that far in the future or whatnot. I definitely thought it was one of those things where it was maybe, let's say, 
five years in the future or something like that. Definitely not a 30-year time jump or whatnot. I definitely wasn't expecting that at this point in time. Okay, I gotta go ahead. <sighs> I really did that. Okay, but uh, let's just start killing people efficiently this time, please. Thank you, Aloy. Um, hello, how are you? Do you like getting shot in the head? I hope so. Thank you, appreciate it. And shoot you. Did I not just shoot you immediately in the head? I shot you twice in the head. There's no way. Thank you for dying this time. Okay, you are definitely gonna get shot in the head. Lovely, perfect. Okay, you. I don't think I can shoot you from here, but you know what? I would love to, um, if I could. Um, but yeah, I didn't realize. If, um, I, I've said that like five million times. But I definitely forgot. I thought Horizon Forbidden West would have been like maybe a ten, uh, five year time skip. Um, obviously, I don't know how this game ends, so I couldn't tell you if it would even make sense for a sequel or whatnot. Because this is definitely one of those games where I have a feeling they. Um, meant it to be a um, standalone like oh god what no you things do not attack me you're not part of this you are not part of this fight okay you understand me you hear what I'm saying you are not allowed to be a part of this hello oh, you up there no stop it I don't like you I don't like you cuz you you hurt me okay can that be more accurate please thank you you guys you stay down there and you don't look at me what did you just do to me I don't like what you just did to me whatever you did to me stop doing that I don't appreciate it. I feel like that is something that you should not be able to do to me. I don't, like I said, I don't know what it was, but just as long as you stop doing it, I will be fine with it. Bandits have a good defense. Better spot all their sentries before I look for the power cells. What sentries? I feel like I can just start killing y'all. Like, are, are y'all supposed to be the sentries? Because you're not very efficient at your jobs, if that's the case. Hello, how are you? Goodbye, see ya, peace out. Um, am I supposed to climb above then? Was I, like, doing the things properly beforehand and then I started doing it bad? Probably. Probably. That's honestly probably the case. Okay. How am I supposed to get up there, then? I was just up there a second ago. Are those machines, like, part of the thing? I don't know. Hello. There are a lot of machines out here. So I'm just going to go ahead and try to avoid them for the time being. Oh, God. Okay. What am I doing here? Um, over this way. Great. Lovely. Okay. How do I get across here? How do you expect me to get across? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Where was I before, even? How did I get over here? I don't remember. Oh, no. Stop shooting me. Stop shooting me. How am I supposed to get across, though? Hold on. Am I stupid? Probably. Honestly, probably. But you know what? I. So I came in from this way. Oh, okay. This is, this is the way I came in from. Okay. I need to get up there and zip line. All right, then. That makes a little bit more sense. But I hate how long it's taking me to do these things. Because this should not be taking this long. But, um... Yeah, now I'm, now I'm like, really intrigued in this sequel or whatnot, because it comes out not too long. It's, what, five months from now, Horizon Forbidden West? And at that point, of course, I'll have my PC as well as a PS5, hopefully, at this point, if it wasn't still impossible to find them at this point. Uh, so that would be great if that were possible, to where I could have a PS5 to actually play the game sometime soon. Hello, how are you? Goodbye. Stop shooting me. Stop shooting me. I said stop shooting me. I said stop shooting me. It's not appreciated. I don't like you shooting me. It doesn't feel good. You should know. I'm shooting you right now, so you should know it doesn't feel very good. Where are you shooting me from? Up there? I was shooting you guys from, like, so far away prior to, like, this or whatever. You guys would have been very dead. This video is going to be a lot longer than the rest of them because I have failed this over and over again. For no good reason. For literally no good reason. This is going to be a 30-minute video because of this. Wow. Great. Lovely. Exactly what I wanted out of this. Okay. But die, please. Thank you. You. Die. You. Stop it. Don't even try. You are not valuable enough to even, like, try to kill me at this point. You. Bye. Please. Thank you. You over here. Where are you? Pop your head out. Pop your head out. You. Oh, God. You are really in a bad situation. Peace out. Oh, my Lord. Aloy is a monster. Okay. Thank you. Appreciate it. Shoot you in the head. Thank you. Um, where are you guys popping up from? Are you going to pop up from? No. no. Doesn't seem like it. Okay. Great. Lovely. Where's the scrap things? Why can't I see him? Okay, the one over here. Great. Um, so what do you want me to there, do with this? There's a power cell. There's a power cell. Perfect. Lovely. Um, where's this one at? supposed to be? Oh, this one. Just right here. Okay, never mind. I thought it was going to be in some type of weird, difficult to find place. But never mind. It's just right in front of my face. Lovely. That's all I need. Um, where am I supposed to get up here? All right. Um, what kind of way you want me to climb up? You want me to climb up a way? Am I, is it climbable? I thought they'd go on forever. Or do I, like, have to... Where, where do I get up to you from? I don't know. Get over here. Jump on top of this. Jump on top of this. Come on. I've cheesed a lot in this game. Let me continue to cheese it. Thank you. Appreciate it. Okay. Up this thing. No. Um, get on top of you. No. 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 Stop falling. Stop falling. I don't appreciate you. No. Let me uh, heal up real quick. Where is my normal potions? I don't have any normal potions left. Wow. Okay. Wasn't expecting that. So it's on top of you. But how am I supposed to get on top of you? 
That doesn't make any sense. Um, hold on. Let's just fall on top of this real quick. I think I'm fine. Yeah, I was going to say, I think fall damage will be okay for me for that uh, little uh, point right there. How do I get on top of the thing for the power cell? Is it not supposed to be on top of the thing? I swear it's on top of the thing or something like that. All right. Um, can I grab onto the rope from here? No. Not seeming... You know what? This is messed up. Why is this happening? Why is this actually happening? Which way am I supposed to go to get on top of that? You know what? This game is really confusing the mess out of me. Let's just fall down here. Let me go back to this way. Is it really on top? How do I get on top? Can I walk through this front door this entire time? No. Didn't think so. Um... I'm just gonna go ahead and end off this episode here. I will figure this out in the next one. That is really stupid. Why can't I just, like, walk up there? Is it from here? Am I supposed to walk around this way? You're gonna make me walk a long path around this way? No? That's a dead end. Um. Great. Lovely. Exactly what I want out of this game. That is the exact thing I want to be happening right now. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. I'm just gonna end off this episode here. If I did go ahead and re-kill him before the next episode, I'll re-kill him. But that's... Why? I don't understand the point. But yeah, other than that, I'd like to say thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you enjoyed it. It's greatly appreciate it. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.